What is up you guys, Bolton 98 and in this video we're going to be talking about Call of Duty Season 6 because Call of Duty itself has posted some new images and new leaks that will show just what we're getting in Season 6. You guys already know, make sure you hit that sub button, it helps the channel out a lot and it only takes 2 seconds of your day. If you don't mind hitting that sub button and leaving a like, that'd be greatly appreciated as we have 87.7% of you guys not subscribed but you guys continue to watch the videos so thank you. But hit that sub button just to show the channel some love. If you decide not to hit it, please let me know down below why you didn't so maybe next time on the channel I can change your mind. So let's get straight into the content. First of all, Season 5 ending very soon. Season 6, Spawn is summoning the Underworld Rises to Call of Duty in Season 6 for September 27th. If you're like me, you don't even know what a spawn is. I didn't know. I just thought he was like a Mortal Kombat or Marvel character. Apparently, he's a elite mercenary who is killed but comes back from hell as a reluctant soldier of the devil. And apparently, he comes from his own comics. Uh, I have pictures here. So, first of all, we'll get into the picture of Call of Duty's image that they give us. Basically, this is the first one you've probably seen numerous times through videos. This one here where you have spawn cut in half. And then you have a operator, obviously, on the other side of him. Now, I thought this operator was COD related, but it does doesn't seem to be it seems to be more related to spawn himself as this is the spawn human form that I found online the best image I could find anyways of his human form um, he is basically looks just like the half of this guy's face so I can assume that spawn will have two different types of skins one being his human form and one of course being the spawn form which wouldn't be the first time they did this because obviously with Snoop Dogg we had two skins. I believe with both battle passes we had two skins because we had the, you know, battle black cell version and the regular version. So they've done this two operator type skin thing before, but it's kind of weird that this is going to be a complete different. Like usually it's just different colors but the same operator. This is actually going to be a whole new operator. So maybe they're two different bundles or not. Also, this might be our very first ever battle pass crossover. So we had a season five battle pass last Last time and this is it um, no crossover we haven't had a single battle pass crossover in Call of Duty yet but it does seem that season 6 may end that drought as we might actually get our very first ever crossover battle pass which is good and bad obviously because it's good because you want to see crossovers in the battle pass it's super cool it's only bad because you don't get to get the skin right away unless you of course you buy all the cod points to upgrade your battle pass all the way or unless it's not a tier 100 another thing with the battle pass being a Halloween theme or crossover theme more other skins are going to be like Halloween like these two skins on the right and left of spawn here look more Halloweeny obviously you have like a uh, ghost skin that is got a mask on that is all black and it looks super cool and the other one wearing like a gas mask of course these are just rumors and this is an image that we saw but it does look very much like this battle pass is going to be a hundred percent seasonal meaning that we will be getting a seasonal battle pass for Halloween basically all the skins are going to be related to a Halloween theme in some sort of way and what I'm seeing this skin battle pass for these three skins right here look super good i really like spawn the only thing that worries me is that he might be a little too big like really big but uh maybe because the skin itself is a really dark black color kind of like black noir and warzone it really won't matter especially if we do get that nighttime map this might be a little op but we'll have to see how they do it also it'd be super cool to get that second operator like that is a normal person and maybe they introduce like an emote where you can change your skin in game where like he can spawn no pun intended but he can basically become spawn through like hitting the d-pad or inspecting your hands or any type of gun or something you can inspect and become spawn or maybe if you do a finishing move and you are the other operator he will become spawn something like that would be super cool in my opinion because we've seen it with fortnite where you can change skins in the game or at least change styles of the skins in the game so it'd be super cool to see it happen here with call of duty it does seem that spawn is going to be a battle pass just because they're making such a huge deal on him and obviously he would be closer to halloween time if he wasn't a battle pass him. so i think the battle pass is going to significantly revolve around him because our last time getting an image like this was of oz i believe and he became our tier 100 skin so i do think that this skin will be our tier 100 skin uh in the battle pass or like maybe a se secret sector that we have to unlock later on in the season which kind of sucks because obviously you want the skin as soon as possible but it does it is better because if you get the battle pass you technically get a crossover skin for free when in other terms it would cost whatever you pay for the battle pass plus if you do the uh, $20 for the cod points and sometimes even crossovers are more than just the 2400 cod points they could be upwards of 30 or 
3100 I mean for the elementals so we don't know if this is a battle pass I don't think it's terrible I think it's actually pretty cool and I think they should begin doing this more often because it's seen a lot of like growth and it keeps the players happy and wanting to play the battle pass I will say the Oz skin was super cool for me but I did kind of give out on it because it wasn't anything that I felt like I needed to work for but with spawn I do think I'll probably work on it a little more let me know what you guys think of this battle pass coming up I will be obviously posting as much as I can on this season 6 update as it's only five days away so make sure you stay tuned for more I will see you guys in the next one peace out